Hey Trios Kids, I am so glad that you're here today. I hope you're already having an amazing day because we've been learning so much about how Jesus loves us and how we can share that love with others. Did you know that you can share the love of Jesus with everyone you meet? In fact, that's what Jesus tells us to do. So when you say, who can love like Jesus? I want you to say, I can love like Jesus, but as loud as you can, okay? Ready? Who can love like Jesus? Whoa, great job, you guys. That was really, really loud. But we're gonna start with worship today, so if you're at home watching this, I would love for you to sing and dance along, okay? So why don't you stand on up from wherever you are and get your singing voice ready. La, 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 la. Get your dance moves ready. And let's get started. Let's see how many cars we have to wash today. Count them with me. One, two, three, four, and five. Are you ready for them to go through the car wash? If you are, shout, go cars, go! Go cars, go! Wow, that was loud. Here we go. Wow, that was so much fun. Look how shiny and clean they are. Ho, ho. It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Ho, ho. Washing cars, are you? It's so much fun to make them bright and shiny and clean. Washing cars is fun. It's true. 
I know a story about washing, too. Listen to this. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Oz got a Bible story for me and you. Hola, friends. I'm Luis the Handyman. So happy to see you today. Check out this car. It belongs to my friend Arturo. I'm helping him fix it because the wheels aren't working. Oh, <laughs> and that's what you do to be a good friend. You help them. In fact, that reminds me of a story. Do you want to help me build it? <laughs> Great, let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible begins with... Jesus. It was the night he had all his friends, the disciples, with him at dinner. His friend John was there, and Matthew, and Peter. They all were at the table. Then, Jesus took a towel and knelt down by his friends. Do you know what Jesus was doing? He was about to wash his friends' feet. His friends had been walking around dusty roads all day, and their feet were dirty. <laughs> Everyone say, Ew! Ready? Ooh! <laughs> yep, talk about a stinky job. Ooh. Now, we need to fill up the bowl with water. Can you guys take your pretend buckets and help me fill the bowl with water? Ready? One, two, three. Ah, good job. <laughs> now, Jesus has water. Then Jesus washed his friend's feet. Huh. Can you believe that? Jesus is so important. He is God's son. Why would someone so important wash his friend's feet? Hmm. Because he wanted to show his friends that he loved them. And you're never too important to love others by doing something for them, like washing their feet. Everyone say, wow. Ready? Wow. Jesus is a good friend. <laughs> hmm, let's think for a minute. If we wanted to be a good friend like Jesus, what could we do to show love to other people around us? What if you're playing outside and your neighbor friend wants to play on your favorite scooter? Do you let them? <laughs> yes, you share your favorite scooter. That is being a good friend. What if there's a long line to get a turn in the bouncy house, but there's a little kid behind you who's really excited to bounce? Do you let them go in front of you? <laughs> yes, you let them go in front of you. That is being a good friend. You already know lots of ways to be a good friend. So start your engines and let's go, go, go and love people like Jesus did. So let's be good friends. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus loved by being a good friend, and we can be a good friend too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, even though Jesus is God's son, he got down and washed his friend's dirty feet. We can do kind things for our friends too. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! This car wash is so cool. I could keep it to myself, but 
I'm gonna go find my friends and let them play with it too. I'll see you next time. for a minute. If we wanted to be a good friend like Jesus, what could we do to show the love to the people around us? Maybe if you are playing outside and your neighbor friend wants to play on your favorite scooter, do you let them? Yes, right, exactly. You share your favorite scooter. That is being a good friend. Hmm. But what if there was a really, really, really long line to get a turn in the bouncy house, but your friend was behind you who was also really excited to go in? Do you let them go in front of you? Right, yes, you would totally let them go in front of you because that is being a good friend. You already know lots of ways to be a good friend, so let's go and love the people like Jesus did. Let's go and be good friends. Can you tell me who can love like Jesus? Good job, exactly. You can love like Jesus. Okay, good job. So why, why don't we pray together today? God, thank you so much for everyone watching from home and joining us today. God, we pray that you would help us. Help us love our friends just like you love us. And God, we just pray that everyone would have an amazing day. We love you. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Awesome. So parents, we encourage you to print out the parent guide on our website to walk through some activities and questions with your kids about today's lesson, or you can just keep watching and press pause on the next few slides. Other than that, thank you so much for joining us, and we'll see you next week. Bye.